If you're working in international development, you're in constant need of reliable and timely data. Data on how to improve your programs and how to increase your impact. About what people think and what they do. About their health, their wealth and their consumption. In short, data about the daily lives of those who should benefit from your programs. Traditionally, these kind of data have been obtained through face-to-face -face interviews with a large number of respondents. But sending teams of interviewers into remote rural areas is costly, time-consuming and sometimes dangerous. Furthermore, in times of crisis and mass migration, it might simply be impossible to trace down respondents to interview them again. Thankfully, technology has come to the rescue and is now complementing traditional face-to-face -face interviews. With the rise of mobile phones in many developing countries, it is often no longer necessary to visit and revisit respondents in order to track changes in their lives. Data can be acquired much quicker, reducing both costs and turnaround times. The World Bank's Listening to Africa initiative showcases this enormous potential of mobile data gathering. Partnering with national statistical agencies and NGOs, the World Bank is piloting to collect data through mobile phone surveys in six African countries. Respondents are provided with mobile phones and a solar charger if necessary. Interviews are conducted by trained professionals working from dedicated call centers. Small incentives in the form of credit top-ups are transferred to respondents after each completed interview. This encourages respondents to participate in the survey and to keep their phones charged. The initiative is already seeing results. In Madagascar, we tracked in real time how increasing food insecurity is affecting the most vulnerable citizens. And in Togo, we were able to monitor the frequency of power cuts that households were experiencing in the country's capital, Lome. If you want to learn more, follow the link to download the World Bank Handbook on setting up mobile phone panel surveys in developing countries.